Knock it on out the but, park. But will it would it have I mean and and this is from somebody who Love Shaka Khan. I went to, I, I made sure that I saw her live when she was in Chicago, all this shit. So it's not like I'm I'm not a fan of hers. But from an aesthetic standpoint, would it have been better if she sang on it versus what he was trying to do sonically with doing the sample and speeding her voice up and all that shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, no, that it wouldn't the- have been because of the way. The his technique and and the way she sings probably wouldn't have matched. But if you would have put her with a DJ Premier, or oh. or maybe who who I'm else he redid the approach, he could have even done it. It's he just... could have even if you would have put her with Just Blaze, she could have done that, and it would have went off flawlessly. Well. See, just Blaze know how to work with vocalists a little bit better, cause like the shit he did with my, uh, what's that song? Uh, it's a game song, the game song with Nas and I, uh, Marsha Ambrosia on the hook, and uh, just did the beat. Whew. That shit is crazy, and it's like the way the beat and her voice is married together is literally like seamless to the point where. It's not like, oh, she just did a hook on here. Like, the whole end of the song is her just singing. So it's literally like they equally were on this song. Like, Game is on the song, rapping, Nas is rapping, and then she got a whole part to just sing at the end with a whole choir. That's starting to sound familiar. I don't know what song it is, but it's uh, starting to sound familiar. Because we record it, and it's not going to sound good, and I'm not going to play myself like that. But... Uh, <laughs> it's very good i'm sure you've heard it before because it's off of uh the second uh game album i believe the doctor's advocate or somewhat or whatever okay. oh. um maybe after i do like a, a edit do this part on the video part of it i'll play it in the background and see if i can find okay. it hopefully they don't they don't uh, plug my shit oh well. motherfuckers really motherfuckers indeed yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that shit, it would just have to be the right type of production. I even saw what um, Manny Fresh did. They said, you have a hit called Back That Ass Up. He said, yep. They said, can you give us a breakdown of it? And he showed them how he did it. I was like, wow, interesting. And he's like, I played all that shit. He said, do y'all hear the horns in the background and everything? And like the orchestra, he said, I did it. all the everything you're hearing. Da-da-da. I did all that. I was like, good man, good man, good job. <sighs> now that that dude is a very super talented. I don't care what nobody underrated. say. Underrated. Manny got- Fresh is dope Man. as fuck. So let's speak to that for a second, because I didn't really care for cash money that much. However, it was certain songs you could not deny that shit because of them beats. Ha, as much as I tried the front like I didn't like that shit, that shit was fucking crazy. Uh, even like the big time of shit, the fucking, uh, uh, what was it? Uh, Still fly some, uh, you know, the like, dun, 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 dun. Right. like even though that's super simple, like it was super catchy too. Like, you be is. humming that, like, I still be humming that shit and be the mad. Hook. Damn it, that hook that's all you need is that hook. <sighs> crazy so yeah no and and, and a lot of people don't understand he uses live instrumentation he may have a guy actually come in and play the guitar yep all the time and you can hear it you can hear it in the the shit that he do i I love manny fresh man that song he has with mac 10 dub c um and ice cube that shit Mm -hmm. is crazy and you don't even know it's Manny Fresh to the end. Well, I knew who I knew who it was. But when I played it for someone, I was like, tell me who produced that. 
And he's like, man, I can't tell who is it. I was like, just listen all the way through to the end. And then you hear Mac 10 go, yo, Manny Fresh, you a fool for this one. Dude, I, I don't know if I heard no dog oh, send that to me. <laughs> send that right now. All right, um, hold on. Start talking. I'm gonna send it to you. What's another joint that I like from him? Oh, uh, the greatest off of uh Urban Legend. You know that's my the, shit. That motherfucker right there. Woo! Heat. And just that beat. Cause he made threw me off. <laughs> <laughs> 